Hello, welcome to the ShareSell Affiliate Segmentation Demonstration. Today we will go over segmenting affiliates with groups and tags. Grouping and tagging affiliates is a great way to organize your affiliates that may have similarities between them. Segmenting affiliates will allow you to filter reports and the affiliate list, set creatives, customize commissions, and send targeted newsletters. First, we'll begin with groups. The purpose of groups is to organize affiliates and provide a commission rate. To group your affiliates, go to Affiliates Affiliate List. In the upper right corner of the page, you'll see View and Create Affiliate Groups. Here, you'll be able to provide a name for the group, also a brief description. You can also choose to keep the sale commission the same or the lead commission the same as your default or provide customized commissions for that group. Once you select Create New Affiliate Group and click Yes, you'll be able to add members to this group. To add a member to the group, you can click the checkbox in the upper left corner of each card, set all groups, and then select group one. Do not forget to confirm your changes. If you would like to remove an affiliate from a group, you can also select the checkbox in each page. Choose unassigned, and that will set the status back to unassigned from the group. Please keep in mind when you are naming your groups to keep them as appropriate as possible since your affiliates will know the name of their group. If you would like to delete a group, you can go to view slash create affiliate groups. At the bottom, you'll see delete an existing group. You can delete the affiliate group. This will only delete the group. It will not remove affiliates from your program. The benefits of using groups is you'll be able to provide a commission rate. Bonus campaigns can also be used. They will have a higher priority in the commission hierarchy than your program default. The one con is it is visible to affiliates and cannot be used in the commission rules. Next, we'll go over how to tag your affiliates. The purpose of using tags is similar to groups, still categorizing your affiliates, but you will be able to use the commission rules with groups. For most merchants, this is their preference as they will also be able to provide multiple tags per affiliate. To tag your affiliates, we'll also go to affiliate and affiliate list again. First, we'll need to create a tag. So you'll be able to click this little tag symbol on each card, then select add tag. If you already have tags in your program, you'll be able to select one of these. Or if you would like to create a new tag because you don't have any tags, you'll be able to select new tag, create new tag, and then enter a label for the tag. You can also provide a note, and then you can also customize it with a color-coded tag. Keep in mind, affiliates will not be able to see the tag name, so you can pretty much name the tag whatever you'd like. If you would like to assign an existing tag to your affiliates, you can also click add tag here. You can click one of the provided tags in the list or tag manager as well, if you have more than 10 tags in your program. If you'd like to remove a tag, you can always click the little X next to each tag. The benefits of using tags, since they can be applied to commission rules, multiple tags can also be assigned to your affiliates tags can also be applied prior to an affiliate joining your program. This includes the recruitment tool and the pending affiliate pages. Thank you so much for joining our video.